New at 10, Reader's Digest says Kingman is the nicest place in Arizona. It's recognition the mayor of Kingman says is setting the record straight more than a year after comedian Sasha Barra Cohen painted the town as a racist and intolerant in his Showtime series, Who is America? Teen Soul's Ryan Cody is telling us how this is part of the healing process for a place still getting over a national black eye, right? Yeah, the Showtime series feasted on Arizona, not only pranking former Governor Jan Brewer, but also former Maricopa County Sheriff Joe Arpaio. But the segment in Kingman was really alarming and ended up being a turning point for the city trying to repair its image. I'm racist toward Muslims. To me, when I hear the word mosque, I think of terrorism. It was supposed to be comedy, but instead... This is not a big deal. Sasha Baron Cohen's fabricated announcement of the nation's largest mosque coming to Kingman turned into a national stain on the city. Black Don't people in Kingman that aren't welcome there either, but we tolerate them. The show dividing Kingman. We all have people that are intolerant. This is how people think. But the controversy also a turning point. Just over a year later, Reader's Digest is naming Kingman the nicest place in Arizona. Totally gratifying because this is the authentic Kingman, the one that I know. Mayor Jen Miles says Kingman was nominated for the title by someone in the city's administration, but Reader's Digest still had to pick it over other places in Arizona. I think the emphasis was to reinforce what is going on in Kingman to celebrate diversity. How much did it hurt you to see the reputation be tarnished? I can only say that my feeling on that was that it was a contrived story and it did not reflect the authentic Kingman, which I think this story is much more authentic as to who we are. If you had the chance to sit across from Sasha Baron Cohen, is there anything you would want to tell him? <laughs> uh, well, I would, I would uh, tell him to reflect on our new Reader's Digest award and consider the fact that that is the true Kingman. Now, Mayor Miles says in her 27 years living in Kingman, she's never even seen the people who made those comments in the Showtime segment, and she's hoping that this newfound recognition can help the city begin moving forward. We're in the Live Alert Center. Ryan Cody, 12 News at 10.